morning, Brian and, and Kevin. And yes. Good morning, and good morning, all the artists are out there. Yes, yes. So Leonor, we got to know Leonor early this year. Uh, by the way, this is Leonor Brazo. I just started recording in case you can't make it to the later class. And uh, we just wanted to give you an opportunity to say hello to some of your artists. All right. So, so good morning, everyone. Um, how is everyone doing today? Everyone okay? Show me with your thumbs up. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> we know that. Hi, then. <laughs> as well. Ivan <laughs> showing his thumbs down. No, Ivan. <laughs> okay, okay. So I want to know if we have some musicians here in the audience. Do we have musicians? If you are a musician, just put thumbs up. Play yes. an instrument. Thumbs yeah. Up. Play oh, instrument. Ivan plays an instrument. Oh, the drums. Hugo. Hugo plays an instrument. Yeah, so um, Rose does not. <laughs> <laughs> All right, does she? Yes, oh, she does. She does. Excellent. You guys can unmute and tell us what instrument you play if you'd like. Tell them what you have. You have this. You have singers. Okay. I like to sing and I like to play guitar. Uh, who's who is that that's talking? Oh, that's you have the scissors. Yeah. Is that Ivan? Emma. 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 Oh, Emma. Very nice. Um, I, um, I play guitar and, and I like to sing. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. That's awesome. All right. So even if you don't play an instrument, um, I just want to remind you that you can do music with unconventional instruments. So you can do music by touching some ob objects you have in your home. Can that's you true. Yes, that's true. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we can do music with we paper. Have... We can do music with paper. <laughs> yeah, and music is really nice because uh, you can express your emotions as well. And it's a big part of our lives because you can hear music uh, everywhere. You can hear music when the rain is falling. You can hear when the car pass by. So everything can be music. And if you put all these sounds together can be a big orchestra. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. That's so right. I just want to share with you that when I was little like you, I learned piano. But later on, I learned the cello. The cello is a big instrument that we play when you are seated. It has a beautiful sound and I love it because it's the closest sound to the, the human voice. So the ones out there like to sing cello, it's very close to our voice. And I don't know if you heard about the famous American cellist, it's called Yo-Yo Ma. If not, ask your parents to play to play for you. It's beautiful. He does a beautiful job, and he, he plays all kinds of music, not only classic. And I think today uh, the lessons is all about music. So I think you're going to have a chance to play as well at the at the end, right? Brian? Yes, absolutely. To play on their artwork. Yes. So, so I hope most of us are making pianos. Oh, good. Piano is a, a beautiful instrument. It's the base. It's a good base for all the sounds. So you can, after you do the artwork, everyone plays. And later on, you can ask your parents to play the piano. And you go around the house and play other instruments. <laughs> to make That's it. right. That's right. Everything That's makes. Right. It's like Bjork. Everything makes music. I hear music everywhere. Exactly. Yeah. exactly. <laughs> So, so I don't yeah, I don't know if the artists or yourself have any question. So well yeah, we do want to get to the, them having questions, but I have one really quick before we turn it over to our young artists. Mm -hmm. uh, could you share a little bit about your new musicians and and what inspired you and why you uh, what made you choose to make that series? Yes, so music as a big part of my life because I was really um surrounded by musicians. My mother uh, was a pianist. Um, I have a brother who is a professional musician, is a clarinetist. And when I grew up in Brazil, 
everyone in my house play instruments. So we used to have the house full of friends all play instruments. So as we move in the house and the kitchen was people playing popular music, you know, on the big living area was the, the chamber music, classic music, and then there were the singers. So it was like a big, a big um, space for musicians. So uh, really has an influence in my life. And that specifically um, series is called the, the blues and it, it reminds me of my friends. So each instrument reminds me one of my friends who play that specific instrument. So I don't know if you want to turn the image and I'll talk about each instrument. So they'll hear a little bit about. Oh, sure. Absolutely. Absolutely. Let's get this, uh, this one up here. Yes. Yeah. So yeah, so this one, yeah, this one is a cello. So it's my myself. I play the cello, and my uh, my the friends too play the cello. Uh, and the one on the right is the saxophone. So uh, and these two on the top, uh, they are very very special to me because I was part of an um, initiative in Washington D.C. that they invited some artists to to paint is is called the police police boxes that in the past they have they had the phone so you could call the police from these boxes but now they have no use so they invite artists from the area to paint inside an artwork so, oh, that's so cool I, yeah so i did um this one the cello one uh, was to honor all the musicians, the, the classic musicians. And this one on the right was to honor all the African-American musicians that live in DC and all the jazz influence, you know, and all the great things they bring to our multicultural universe. Uh, the two on the bottom, uh, the one on the bottom is, the, is a piano. And I think the lesson today is, is more about this one. So it reminds me of, my mother was a pianist and some other friends. And one on the right is the clarinet. And this is, lo even looks like my brother. <laughs> my <Aww>. brother. Um, <laughs> oh, live Zoom. <laughs> uh, so this one uh, on the bottom um, right is my brother playing the clarinet. Oh, how wonderful. Yeah, yeah, he's a professional player and he lives in Rio de Janeiro. He gives some lives um, often, so um, that's something nice. He's Brazilian music, not only Brazilian music, other kinds of music he plays, it's beautiful. Oh, that's wonderful, that's wonderful, my goodness. Well, I just have to thank you so much for sharing a little bit about yourself and your, sure. and your music and your art with us. And if you have a minute, I'd love to turn it over to our young artists and see if they have any questions for us. 